Hey there, everyone. This is SoCal playing ASMT, and honestly, let's just rip off that band aid. Super Puzzle Deluxe doesn't even have a Super Puzzle standard. You start with the Deluxe Edition right from the start. Uh, a pretty maddening puzzle level, possibly. I'm hoping that I just have enough residual memories that it's not so bad. There's a springboard down there. I forgot if it's relevant. Relevant. That's a reset door. Like, there's a mushroom that erased my thing, so that wasn't great. Like, dang it! And, uh, yeah, I needed that shell, so I'm gonna need a reset door. Starting off pretty good, and you restart here though. So make sure you destroy this man before you interact with the rest of the land. So we do a little bit of this, right? That gets us a vine. And I think we need to like chuck something down there. There's another mushroom if you want it, because there's something here. So okay. So by going here, we despawn, yeah, the shell, so that it's back at its original place. No, nothing too unusual here. Then you do a little bit of that, and that gets to spring down, then you get yourself the feather! Which gives you a cape, and gives you the ability to ignore everyone. You're supposed to still have that shell with you. How do you know that ahead of time? You don't! <laughs> That's just the reality of it. I don't think you can know ahead of time. Who despawning and respawning. Which in this case is a positive attribute. Here we go. Alright, but don't go flying off too quickly. That'd be ridiculous. You gotta bring it more. Alright, this time I don't have to wait by the vine pool though. Fly using my ability to fly. Whoa, fly bird! Alright, don't do anything dumb. Sweet. Alright, don't get her here. Uh, so another shell is required, but I think this time, yeah, we get it from somewhere else. We're not gonna get that silly bean. screen a little bit, make it a little bit easier for everyone. There you go, because that gives us the silver pea. It's the pea that is gray. Oh, don't tell your doctor, alright? Um, if I throw up, I can put it there. There we go. Convert all of these into money, and here we get a middle point ground. Yeah, there's a thing up there for bring like a springboard, I think. And I believe the cut between evil and good is like here. So no matter what you do, you will end up here, get shot in the face. It's Killer from Mega Man! All of Mega Man continues. This fall! Alright, so you need to bop these. There's a whole bunch of delicious candy treats for you and your hair to eat. Uh, the social function of your choice. Mine is Alexander the Great Day Festival of Movies. And then you're like, whoa, what's a clock? I don't know, what's a sock? And then everyone laughs, but no one knows why. Uh, is there anything else I want to know, or do I just go and get the shell after I'm creating a new age of espodiosis? I don't know, I'm just saying things, man. Alright, oh, that's a... See, I... Hmm... So I think it's too late to get uh, the star to get to that exit, so we'll go to another exit, that's fine. We can use our shell here, we can return here. Look, I'm kind of rediscovering the level live as I'm playing it, so this is the vine, the bottom one is the vine. I wanted to hit the vine first, basically. And, uh, I, I backed the wrong horse. I mean, it happens. That's why you don't believe in the horseplay. That's just gonna leave the problems down the road. Whoa, check it. Whoa, yeah, that happened. Arrow. Uh, alright. Calm down, shell. Calm down, shell. Or enter the door. One or the other. One or the other is good. I'm here now! It's the vertical section. I kind of... So, yeah, you're supposed to follow the vines here. <laughs> Fair enough, I guess. 
can kind of see the top of their heads. Here you need a Yoshi, bring some bread, spin jump down the thing, and hope for the best. Yeah, here you just kind of jump down and die. Um, was there a way that I could control the scroll a little bit better? I have no idea. Well, for now I'm just doing my best not to die. I think that's a good approach. Trust in the coins. And end up in a very awkward spot here. You know those flames? You guys are doing a very bad job thawing it off. You know, like considering y'all are fire. So you need to get here bigger than a drum. Uh, like going down there to hit those boxes it seems so neat. What happens if I just go into R? I'm just gonna go into R. See what happens. I love. Okay. So see, it brings back here. Big again. And one of the things we want to do is hit that thing there. Like, you need to fly to get that, basically, right? Uh, this is kind of mean, honestly. Or do you get, like, a structure with a P switch? I'm not sure. It's a super deluxe puzzle. The puzzle is the slide didn't slide, which is a rare complaint. Like, here, like, where do you go? I don't know. Like, this, to me, obviously means a Yoshi is involved somewhere. I don't- I don't remember where spikes are. Alright, so I think that a good goal here are those yellow blocks that I didn't dare, like, do anything with. Well, now I'm gonna be able to set the fire on fire, so it's gonna be a lot more safe, in theory, at the very least. Ah, the coins here didn't respawn. That's nice. Check it out, we are now somewhere, I don't understand. Alright. Something is in this. Okay, there's something in both of these boxes. Now that's exciting. Okay, so we use my newly given ability to fly to get to the top and hopefully get like that. That, a question block at the top is probably a Yoshi. Uh, so I didn't go out of my way to destroy all flames of the universe, and I feel like I'm regretting that. Kind of a dangerous up zone. All right, here I'm safe enough to fly. Here we go. Now I can get here. So the goal to get that Yoshi is that now I can get the P switch. But is there any indication of where I want to use that P switch though? Like clearly, either there's a door or there's something somewhere. But. Where? I guess I'm just going to press it and look around? Like, it's not indicated at all, I don't think. Unless I just forgot something. I pro I bet I just forgot something. Here, you bring it here. Okay. Yeah, no, yeah, see, I just forgot. I just completely escaped my mind. Alright, alright, alright. I got, I got the feathers already. I managed to save one of them at the last second, so I don't need to redo everything, only a part of everything. You know what? That's okay. Do the puzzle ice! That's a different level in World Cities. Ooh, I'm surprised that went as well as it did. Eh. I'm starting to get a bit worried about my time, but hey, you know what they say about Grandma Gemstone, nothing. You don't talk about her. It's you. You were right when you said you didn't know. That's the right answer. Congrats. Uh, all right. So don't swallow it, though, please. There we go. It's a. a yeah, I'm looking at a timer and I'm starting to get worried. This is a 999 type of timer. You know, you don't put that for fun. Well, sometimes you put that because you're lazy or. You don't really want to figure out how much time you want. But most of the time, most of the time, it's pretty scary. But at the same time, maybe it's just for that. It's to give you some amount of let, you know? Let your restart a little bit from time to time. But in that case, why not just not put a timer at all? Look, some things you just don't do. So here, the watermelon, they give your Yoshi mad hops. 
Whenever a Yoshi, you know, gets his feet tickled by a melon, he just can't stop but do a big hop. And I don't know if you've noticed, but there's some chunky ice up there on the ceiling, and that's just gonna destroy your brain, alright? So, just down like that. I was sure there were, like, Koopas kicking shells or something, but I guess I just must have seen a triangle. See, there's a puzzle ice. I doubt we're gonna do puzzle I don't know, this took not as long as I thought it would. Let's see how the second half goes. Mash that select again! Ah, oh, but it's inside a hill. He already thought about it. I did it. I did it. 2.0. So, Vine has... Well, I guess I... Ooh. <laughs> Here we go. Got my jump held button. There we go. And we do that for the express purposes invincible. Now, the fun thing is, I'm still, like, there are plenty of opportunities to die here, but you know what? That's fine for now. It's not, but it's fine. Whatever. I don't know what I'm talking about. Hey, get power-ups back, so it's fine. So, uh, this is like Blind Jump Central, where you just kind of have to jump and trust that a Bunzai Bill is gonna spawn. I remember that tricking me for a while. There, the placement was super bad, but I'm good. The music pops a lot, I don't know why. Alright, here we go! Da -da 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 jump. No, I'm somewhere else at all. I remember that once upon a time... A key didn't spawn? It's been a while. I think you can do some things up there, but like, there's icicles everywhere. You don't want to cut yourself on an icicle if you can stop it, if you can help it. Like, their climbing animations are kind of weird. It implies hands. No? I don't know. Maybe? Maybe not. Alright, so then you're here and you're like, whoosh! Oh, I'm whooshing. But maybe I don't want to. Yeah, I need a P switch somewhere. Okay. Eh, well, I sure got hit twice. And now I'm up here. Where I can't. I don't. We got anything to do. Alright, well, I've made a bad decision somewhere along the line. How about you? Oh, okay. Absolute confidence! Confidence absolute! Absolute skill! Yeah, you just kinda have to go and it feels bad. Alright, so, uh, missing things somehow case of the I needed a P-switch to do anything. Like, is it up here? I mean, it could be. Ay, uh, there's that P-switch. What a silly little guy. Um, I guess you throw it up and you catch it like that. Alright. Why is the music weird? Is this just me or is... Oh boy, in here? Okay, well... Uh, there we go. That's all you need to make happen. But no, yeah, like, the instrumentation got wrong or something. Eh, perfect. Ah! Perfect, still. Ah, uh, it just it keeps being perfect. Alright, um... You know what? Maybe that's for the best. Where's the key? Where's the key? What's going on? Why are you bringing me here? What? <laughs> what? Okay, something's broken. It's gonna be a bit trickier, but I can do. Alright, you know what? I'll just... This is just not working out, so I'll just take the hit. So what? I'm hoping that there's a key here now? <sighs> what am I hoping about? Okay, so there's a key somewhere, maybe, instead, then. What if the key's up there? Like, there is that one block. Like, there's no springboard anywhere. What if the key's there? I mean, it doesn't filter you, so I can just get a cape somewhere. Or you can get a cape, so let's go to the obvious source. 
Like, I had one earlier before then. No, no, there's one at the start of the level. There is one at the start of the level. Alright, so, that mysteriously indicated block. Turns out, I don't remember everything. There's a key. Okay. I had forgotten about that detail, not gonna lie. Alright, well, that seems like a huge hassle to get every time, though. Oh, maybe you're supposed to bring the shell back with you. Huh, that's not impossible. And you bop it up. Yeah. So like, after using the shell to do everything. Okay, I'll believe it. So that- wait. So how does this work on the net? Well, you go on the internet and you say to Rooter, hey, bring me to Lake Water. Is that a place? That's such a generic sounding place. Anyways, then your persona ends up there. You laugh, you cry, and you smell some beans. I guess what I can do is just play badly. Ah, how did that happen? I don't know how that happened. Like, can you double grab here? Like, I feel like I don't really want to try. So, uh, like, do I want to just bring it over and then come back? Like, is that easier? I mean, it depends what you do. Oh, and... <sighs> but the key, it's, you got one shot. <laughs> There you go. So just make sure to throw it very, very, very... Uh-oh. Uh, uh right, you know what? That's fine. Yeah, so just put it here. Then we can return. The key's gonna stay there. And yeah, like the P-switch, I can drop it down the hole as many times as I want. Now, why does the reset, though, bring you on the wrong path? Because this would be a lot less mad. Well, okay, I guess it does it because if you don't got the key, you're just not gonna get it because the key is in another area completely. So it gives you. S I don't know. That's very weird decisions overall been taken. All right, so I don't know what's happening here. I guess you want to be small makes it more easier for everyone involved and going through all of this lets you scale puzzle ice I, I, I even with this I know why I'm doing it like I've been playing for way past my my end time normally but I remember this level being a lot simpler and I always thought it was super weird uh, I mean, first of all, just like the sheer coincidence of having two ice puzzle levels right next to each other. Because like, remember, the way this game was made, everyone picked their spot on the map and went from there, right? So, two individual picked the place in the ice place, and right next to each other, both decide to do a puzzle level. The thing is, this one is so much more simple and basic, it's really awkward. Alright, so you, you do that, let's do that. I'm not getting any Dagadon. Dagadon can stay home. It's fine. Then you pop back here. Whoa, do you need another? Yeah, you need both kinds. Uh, so, welcome to the supermarket of ideas. And then you get stuck here. You gotta wait for a peace switch to prevail so that you can continue and do another puzzle here. Gotta find a silver here. I found a cape and that guy's a gun. I found a blue pea. I don't know what to do with you. I'm gonna press you. You get a bridge, you get rid of a wall. You can fly off the door. You can pound on the ground and do with sprar. Oh shoot, that's a bad. Uh, probably. Uh, yeah, cause I need that silver pea. Like I need those dinosaurs, horseman. <sighs> well, what can I say? I had an accident. 
right, let's not accidentally press on you again, huh? How about that? Like, that's all you need to do to make sure that doesn't happen again. But it just kind of fell on me, and you know what? Accidents happen sometimes. Like, that's just the reality. It's always unfortunate. Now you're doing shit like, whoop, you get hurt up here. There you go. Oh, I thought I got hurt. I guess I didn't. Uh, Man, so many lives back, though. I appreciate it. Thank you. This is the reward for taking... Like, it's like a hidden reward. Like, yeah, like, that level's a bit out of the way. But if you do it, you know, you might get a couple of lives at the end. And that's that's kind of nice. It's like they took into consideration that this is one of those optional out-of-the-way thing. And yeah, it's just, again, it's just the strangeness of having these two levels dubbing themselves puzzles, but the experience is so different. The level of obfuscation is so different. It's just, it's just strange. It's just strange, man. Anyways, that didn't go that bad, I guess. I don't know. You decide.